theory. Dimensional analysis is just the study of units. If I have 34 kilometers, these are the units for dimensions. Um, so when we're talking about dimensional analysis, we're talking about looking at the dimensions or the units. This is often called conversions. Okay. The best way to learn is just to do an, ex an example problem. So let's take, let's say we have six liters of soda pop. And let's say that we want to convert this to gallons. In order to do that, we need to have a conversion factor. Now we know that one gallon equals 3.785 liters. Because of that, we can make two different conversion factors. We can either divide by gallons That will give us 1 equal to 3.785 liters over 1 gallon. Okay. Or, we can divide by the 3.785 liters. gives us this conversion factor. One gallon over 3.785 liters equals one. So now we have two conversion factors. We have this equal to one, or we have this equal to one. Well, when you're doing conversions, you can always multiply by one and it doesn't change the value. So if our starting volume is 6 liters, we can multiply this by either one of these values of 1. So we can multiply it by this or by this. Because liters is on the top, we can assume this is over 1, we will want to multiply by this value or this conversion factor. So we take it and we say 1 gallon divided by 3.785 liters. Now, the important part of dimensional analysis is crossing out your units. When you have, you have a unit on top, such as liters, and the same unit on the bottom, you can cross those out. So once we crunch our numbers, divide 6 by 3.785, we have now converted from liters to gallons. And whatever that would be. So we get 1.6 liters.